What is the number one reason that women cheat? Don't you? I got you. I think it's just, it's more of a response to disrespect. It's def I think it's definitely emotional attachment because someone out there is giving them something that you're not giving them, whether it be time, whether it be passion, whether it be just compliments or listening to how their day went. Like, mm -hmm. it's they're looking for something that you're not giving emotionally right. and they want that emotional connection. So that's why they are going to find somewhere else. Like, I mean, but some women are just dogs. Yeah, straight up, like, <laughs> out in the streets, like running the streets. Like y'all think you run the streets, they run the streets. Yeah. Like, that's how it is. Some people, they just change cheap. A lot, a lot of women are usually two steps ahead. Yeah. So, so you think you run a game, you're not. You're not. <laughs> you're really not. Look, fellas, understand something. If you're in a relationship with a woman, right, and you're doing everything right, except one thing, that one thing is enough to make her cheat on you. Just that one thing. So if you're a man and you got your shit together, you like put it down in bed, she's happy, she's pleased. Um, like you a leader, you a provider, you provide for the household and thing. If you do all those things and let's say to her, you're not sensitive enough. Just by her feeling that you're not sensitive. If she come across a guy that she thinks is showing his sensitive side, that's enough to make her cheat on you understand that man with women if you're not doing one thing right just one thing that's enough to make a cheat dog and that's kind of crazy right and another thing with women is this right women have a beehive mentality so they have a hive mentality what that means is this they, they follow other women. So let's say a chick have a good man at home, right? He's doing everything right. He's a good man. If other women are going for a particular type of guy, all of a sudden, your girl mindset might change towards you if the girls that she hang around view other guys a certain way and they view your guy and they view you as like a good guy and they view the, the other guys as more fun guys and things like that before you know it your girl mindset will change based on who she hang with or based on who she's around women have a very high mentality bro if you don't believe me look in a shade room like sometimes you will see a post where it's like, okay, so don't nobody have an unpopular opinion? Why everybody have to agree? Because the thing about women is like, nobody wants to be the one to disagree. They are all scared to disagree with each other at times. So they're all just comfortable just going with the flow. But nevertheless, though, nevertheless, fellas, the bottom line is this, man. Your chick could cheat on you for any particular reason, but... It have a lot to do with her emotional connection. That, like, women are emotional creatures, bro. So let's be careful out there, all right? So wait, so I've heard that before. Like, a man said to me, it's like, you know, I can't have my girl, my girlfriend, my woman, tell me come in my mouth. I'm like, what? Okay, but wait, and then but I said, but a dirty hoe, yeah. but a hoe, if I have a hoe, and I fuck she a hoe, she would do it. I'm like, wait, but don't you want your wife to be that hoe to you? Like, that's always like a back in the bed, a day in the streets. Yeah. And he's like, no, I can't. I just don't see it. I guess she kisses my kid. I'm like, 
rather be open sexually with a hoe. Someone that I'm just gonna smash, be with, and never see again, or just have it for that. And but with my wife, I can't. And that's the thing about men, it's like it's very cut and dry for them. It's like when they when they meet girls, it's like, okay, this is somebody I wanna fuck, this is somebody Someone, I wanna yes. get into a relationship with. It's very black and white and cut and dry. For women, we have we have depth. We're like, no, I can see you in this role. Yeah. I can see you in this role. We, I, we I, say I can fuck him, I can fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? It's called Men Are Like Waffles. And women are like, again, okay. okay. So men are, you know, waffles. Because yes. they're compartmentalized. Yes. Right? Yes. And women are like, forget it. Because we bring everything together. Interesting. Yeah. Like it. Look, fellas, man, understand something, dog. They are all freaks, bro. You got to get that good guy shit out of your mind. A lot of dudes be meeting girls and shit, and once they fall in love like with a girl, all of a sudden in the bedroom, they don't want to dog them out. They don't want to come in their face. They want to act like they fucking Virgin Marys. All women want you to fucking dog them out in the bedroom, fam. All women want you to talk dirty to them, dog. Y'all have to separate that mindset of, okay, so she's a good girl, so let me treat her like a good girl in the bedroom. No, buddy. No, I'm not saying, yeah, see, that's the thing, is that you could treat your girl like a queen all you want, you know what I'm saying? But when you get to the bedroom, fam, you got to do your job. She don't want a good guy in the bedroom. She want a wild, freaky ass dude in the bedroom, fam. She want to do to fucking dog her ass out. She want to be fucked. So some of you dudes got to change your mindset, man, because... That's part of the reason why y'all fucking girlfriends be cheating on y'all. Because y'all not fucking wild in, in, in the bedroom and shit. And she gonna lust for that shit. And she will go out and seek a dude who is smacking that ass across the fucking room all day. That's just what it is, bro. Y'all gotta stop looking at your girls as these fucking precious, beautiful, saint yo... They are all freaks, man. Your wife, she wants you to come in her face. She wants you to come in her mouth, but she wants you to give her that feeling, though. She wants you to dominate her. Where she can look at you and be like, come in my face, daddy. Yeah, bitch, take that. They want that fam. They want you to talk dirty to them. I don't give a fuck who she is. They all got that side to them, man. Don't be a fool and think that your girl don't. <laughs> don't be a fool and think she ain't got that side to her because you wifed her up. That ain't going to change nothing. She's a woman. Women have that freaky nature to them, fam. That's just who they are. The problem is they need a man to bring that out of them. All right, you know what? I'm going to keep it real with you. If you got a girl and you're not bringing your girl freaky side out, fam, she's probably going to cheat on you, dog. If you're not bringing her wild side out, where she wants to do whatever in the bedroom. Whatever you tell her she doing. Fam, it is what it is, man. You got to talk dirty to your girl in the bedroom. Like, you got to call her a dirty bitch. You got to call her, you nasty ass. Like, yo, you got to call all that shit. That's what she want. Because she wants you to... Tap into her freaky nature. She wants you to bring that shit out of her. Don't be a fool, dog. Don't take that good guy energy bullshit in the bedroom, too. You're going to get away with it. Um, being a good guy, you know what I'm saying? Like, in the, you know what I'm saying? Just on an everyday. You know, just being a... I mean, that shit is cool. But trust me. You take that good guy shit in the bedroom, too? Oh, it's over. It's over. 
it's over, fam. <laughs> If you feel like, if you dog out like that, if you look at a, a, a like a slut, fam, that's how all women are. They're all freaks, bro. <laughs> so y'all dudes got to wake up out here, man, all right? 